Whenever I like took my glasses off, I would see two of myself. It looked really weird because I wouldn't be able to like see straight. When I first got prism glasses for Allie, the thickness of them, I was quite shocked. I said to the eye doctor, how much thicker are these things gonna be? Because when I bring these home to her, I don't think she's gonna be very happy. My eyes kept getting worse, so this is how big they were. Like, they were so thick. When I brought the prism glasses home, I showed them to her, <laughs> and she was in tears. I was so embarrassing. Hey, I'm Allie LaPerge. I'm 15, and I'm from New Milford, Connecticut. I've been wearing glasses since kindergarten like every day, so. Allie had a condition where her eyes were crossed from when she was about age three. Strabismus affects approximately 3% of the population. Yes, we're here to see Dr. Howell. When I first met Allie, she had a lot of prism in each lens, which made it very hard for her to participate in sports. I play attack, which is offense, and I like to score and like help people score, get assists and stuff. Over here. I have my prisms on during the day. Then I have my cages for field hockey and lacrosse. And I just put it on over this and it looks ridiculous. The aim of strabismus surgery is to get the eyes to be straight so they can use the eyes together. It's her eyes. And you never know, like, is she gonna be blind? Is it gonna work? The surgery usually takes about 50 minutes and it's done under general anesthesia. It's outpatient surgery, so the patient goes home and sleeps at home that night. What's right below that? 638. Okay, so you're doing great. Dr. Howard was like really nice. Like she's so calm and like she doesn't like, <laughs> she tells you what exactly she's gonna she do. To follow. And, like how it's gonna fix everything. In Allie's case, her eyes were turned in. So we weakened the muscle that was turning her eye in so that it couldn't turn in the way that it did before. And if this muscle is weaker, the eye straightens. Yeah. <laughs> Coming out of the surgery, she said, there's only one. And I just go like this. And so we're like, you're not two. You're not two. You're only one. And then she'd like fall back down. <laughs> All right, so now I want to see how well you're healing, OK, from the side of the surgery. Can you take your glasses off? Here. The standard care from Yale Medicine was great. And look straight ahead and look left and down a bit. Allie, you look great. The surface is healed beautifully. No more operations, huh? Your eyes are nice and straight now. It's such an improvement. I'm really happy to see how well you're doing. Well, I had my surgery on May 19th and six weeks after. Does this mean I can get contacts now? Yes, it does. Awesome. But I'm not gonna get them until school starts. Cause I'm like on vacation and everything, so. <laughs>